I'm Nick the History Kid. I'm the young patriot who loves history. Today, I'm in Richmond, Virginia at the Confederate White House. This was the official residence of the first and only president of the Confederate States of America. During the Civil War, Jefferson Davis and his family lived here. This home served much like its northern counterpart, as a hub of social activity and strategic decision making. Jefferson Davis was the president of the Confederate States of America. He graduated West Point Military Academy and served in both houses of Congress. He did not want to end the Civil War, but General Lee finally did it with the surrender at Appomattox. Jefferson Davis fled Richmond only to be caught and put in prison for two years and released because of poor health. He was stripped of his citizenship and died 12 years later as an author. On April 4, 1865, just two days after Jefferson Davis abandoned this house and left Richmond, and just one day after Union forces occupied the city, Abraham Lincoln came up to the Confederate Capitol and walked up these steps with his son Tad. While here, Lincoln ate a small lunch and toured the rooms. Lincoln then met with a Confederate general to discuss about possible ways to bring Virginia back into the Union. This happened one week before Lincoln was assassinated. Now a National Historic Landmark, this southern treasure is a premier artifact in the biggest collection of Confederate artifacts anywhere in the country.
The Union Army used his home as headquarters until the end of Reconstruction. It was then returned to Richmond by the federal government. Until next time, I'm Nick the History Kid, and remember my state slogan, New Jersey, from the Revolutionary War to the Jersey Shore, with history and fun awaits you.